Hello Unlimited Friends, it's Zara back again with another video about the Law of Attraction. And today, instead of answering a question from one of you, I want to share with you my powerful, life-changing morning routine. This morning routine consists of five things that I have been doing for, oh my God, so many years now. And I truly, truly believe that these five things are at the basis of the amazing life that I've created. And all of it can be explained based on the law of attraction and the teachings of Abraham. So let me share with you what these five things are. Number one is waking up relaxed. Waking up completely relaxed and feeling at peace. Not picking up on thoughts from the previous day, not reaching for my phone, just laying in my bed and listening for the sounds around me. And I can usually pick up the sounds of birds outside. I can pick up the sounds of my cats. I can pick up the sounds of my dog. If the children are in the house, I can pick up sounds of uh, coming from their rooms. And just listen, awaken your five senses. And the two senses that are the most important are our sense of sight and our sense of hearing. So I look out of my window at the tree that is outside my window. And it just makes me feel happy. So when you wake up on a happy and relaxed note, you've put yourself on a high vibration. If you wake up stressed, then that your whole day is going to be stressed. So how do I wake up relaxed? That's the key. And how I wake up relaxed is by pre-paving going to bed the previous night. I pre-pave going to bed every single night and I consciously tell my mind to stop thinking. And I instruct my body to heal. And I tell myself that I'm going to wake up feeling refreshed and energized and happy for my day. So you wake up relaxed if you have prepaved the previous day. And if you follow this practice and you do it, you will absolutely see a change in just 10 days, I promise you. But if you keep doing this practice over and over again for many years, then your entire life will change. So this is a practice that everyone who is doing the Law of Attraction 40-day workout with me is part of. And I can tell you people start sleeping deeper, having a more refreshing night's sleep and just completely changing their lives. And you can find the pre-paving that I use in this workbook. So this is the Unlimited 40-Day Law of Attraction Workbook. It is available on Audible. It is available on Kindle as an ebook. It's also available in print. So if you are interested in the pre-paving exercise, pick up the workbook and join the workout. Now, not surprisingly, number two on my list is pre-paving. So I go to bed pre-paving, but then when I wake up in the morning, the first thing I do is pre-pave. In fact, the waking up and listening to the sounds and the pre-paving are kind of happening together because I usually pre-pave and then fall back into sleep and then wake up and pre-pave again. So pre-paving my day, telling myself that it is my intention to have a good day. And there is a beautiful pre-paving that is contained in the workbook. There's a specific wording that I use that I have been using for the past 15 years now, and I can tell you that it is absolutely life-changing. So pre-paving is a powerful exercise. If you want to learn more about pre-paving, I'm going to link a video right up here so that you can find out more about it. That's number two. Number three, the third thing that I do every single day, soon as I get out of bed and I go to the bathroom, I look at myself in the mirror and I appreciate myself 
I say good morning to myself. I tell myself that I'm going to have a fantastic day. And then I tell myself that I am beautiful. I am amazing. And then I say, Zara, whose life are you going to change today? So it puts me in the mindset of being someone who brings value to everyone around me. So that's number three. And it contributes to your self-worth. It contributes to your confidence. It helps you to focus on yourself and appreciate yourself. All right. Number four is I come downstairs and then I take Stella, my dog, for a walk. And that is my time for appreciation. As I go on my walk, I appreciate. The first thing I notice is the temperature outside. And it doesn't matter if it's cold or, it, or it's warm. Whatever temperature it is, I notice it. I focus on it to the exclusion of all else. And I appreciate it. And then I appreciate the sky. And then I say hello to the trees. And then I bless all the people who live on my street as I walk by their homes. And I appreciate the squirrels in the morning, the bunny rabbits that I see. A lot of times I just appreciate how green the grass is. If it's fall, I appreciate fall colors. If there's snow on the ground, I just appreciate how beautiful the snow looks. You can always find something to appreciate. And nature is so easy to appreciate. And I just find that breathing all the way in. So a lot of times during our day, we have short breath. We just breathe in our chest. We don't breathe all the way into our tummies. But breathing into our tummies is really a very, very amazing thing to do. And it's actually number five on the list. So number five on the list is getting some stretching in. When you stretch your body, you automatically breathe all the way into your tummy. So just doing a couple of stretches, whether you have time, like if you have a busy day in the morning, some people are rushing about because they don't have enough time to actually do a workout or go for a walk. But I can tell you that if you just take two minutes, just two minutes, just to stretch and allow your body to breathe all the way into your diaphragm, that is enough to get the flow of energy moving through your body. And when you allow energy to move through your body, you are clearing the resistance that's stored in your body. You are energizing yourself for your day. When you have energy moving at a fast speed through your body, you feel refreshed. You feel amazing. And it puts your thoughts in a positive place. So these five things are so, so important in putting ourselves on the right trajectory. As Abraham says, you're in the right trajectory for having a good day. And if you can have a good day today and then repeat that, having a good day tomorrow, and then suddenly it's a week and you've had a good week, your life just keeps getting better and better and better. And this is conducive to having a really good, peaceful day and ending your day feeling peace in your heart and then repeating it all the next day. I can tell you that these five things are fundamental to the practice of law of attraction because the law of attraction is all about appreciation, the power of your focus, thinking positively. And these are the five things that I do on a daily basis that help me to do exactly that. And now you can take this and make it part of your life as well. Thank you for joining me here today. I love hearing from you. If this was helpful, please, please, please post a comment. YouTube loves comments. It's a way, it's a, a non-monetary painless way for you to support my work and I would really appreciate it. And further, if you have a question that you would like me to answer for you, please leave your comments, uh, leave your question in the comments below or send me an email through my website zimahoon.com. Thank you again for joining me and I hope that you will subscribe if you're new to the channel and come back for my next video.
Take care, folks. Love you all lots. Bye for now.